Hello, today we are going to talk about how to connect the Growbot inverter. We have a battery 16S, 48 volt, which is connected to our BMS 150 amp, and we have a Growbot inverter here. So there are two methods to connect the uh, inverter, which is directly to the BMS, and second, is, second method is to connect to the WNT port. Today we are connecting inverter to the BMS directly through RS485 cable. You need to make sure you are connecting right, you are connecting RS485A and B cable correctly to the BMS. So we have connected correctly here, so we will connect it to the BMS. You can use the Bluetooth app to connect. Here you can see all the information of your battery pack, the voltage, overall voltage, the individual voltage, you can see every maximum, minimum voltage, you can see it here. And you go to parameter settings, go to parameter settings, and there's a protocol type, you can select any of the inverter brand. You can see there are, there are a lot of inverter brands like Sofer, Victron, Goodway, and you can select here Growbot. And whatever the communication you are using, we are using today, we are using 485, RS485, so we'll set, select RS485 and set. So enter the password, it is one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, it's already successfully set. So you can see here that the, the voltage shown in the inverter and the app is the same. It's 51.4, it's 51.4. And the SLC is here, 40, 42, and same is on the inverter, it's 42. So the BMS and inverter are correctly connected. So the second method is to connect to WNT port. You need to make sure the WNT port is correctly connected to the UART port of the BMS. And you are connected RS485 port here to your PSC computer. So open this PC software, go to the common mode. Since we are using RS485, you open the RS485 here. So you can see all the data of battery pack here. Uh, total voltage, SLC, individual cell voltage, everything. And you go to the admin here. The password for admin is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Enter it. So you go to the manufacturing here. So you can, you can see here, Inverter brand is here, so you can see a lot of inverter brands here, like like the one I showed earlier in the app, mobile app. You can see a lot of inverter brands. So you need to select here Growbot. For example, you are connected right now. We are connected Growbot, so you need to select the Growbot. So the second one is port type. We are using RS485, so we need to select 485 and select both of them. Set, set. So it's all set here. So you can see here. The total voltage, you can see it 51.5 volt and the SOC is 42 volt. So you can see we have successfully connected the inverter. Now we will check it by connect the load. So we will connect the load. You can see it's working now. And you can also see the uh, output current here. Okay, if you have any further questions, you will contact us. We will try our best to answer. Thank you.